three, two, one, go. All right, another 99999CC speed run. We're back. Hey guys, it's Troy here, and this is going to be really challenging compared to the previous ones because we are gonna lose an additional two seconds per race due to black loading screens because CTGP has gone through some updates and it's made the games run uh, a little bit slower. So, so that is gonna make this 5306 time that we're facing today, our previous PB. It's gonna be a... Uh, it's gonna be an extra minute more challenging than it appears to be, so we'll see how we do. And regardless, it's gonna be extremely fun. I like to call this the annual speedrun category because we do like one or two of these a year, that's it. Oh my god, we're not even first. Wow, these CPUs have been practicing. These CPUs have been practicing a lot. Oh my gosh, I got second, second on the first race. I think I only got something other than first maybe like two times in the last run. That is crazy how good they are. Wow, yeah, so this speed run we use Bitbike because, you know, acceleration and handling are the most important stats on this category. Drifting is impossible, you're going way too fast. We don't even reach full potential speed very often in the speed run. We only do it when we have to charge standstill main turbos to do shortcuts. That will happen occasionally, but luckily we have the speedometer this time showing up so you guys can see how absurd it is, how ridiculous it is that we actually get to these stupid fast speeds so quickly. All right, Moo Moo Meadows is really fun on this one. Track curves nicely. And. All right. That was good, that was good. There's a couple bad spots. There's this one at the end of the level that you can get stuck in. Um, if you get too much speed here, you just got a curve your angle left. See, I almost got stuck in at that time. But yeah, 33 solid. And we're off to a good start, even though we got second place on the first race, which was so surprising. I still can't go over that. All right, Mushroom Gorge. I'll do my best to talk about each race, what goes through my mind when playing each one, so you guys uh, are on the same page as me, because it just looks ridiculous. It's one of these categories that nobody plays, and it's a mod that you know some people have played, but it's not like super popular. It's more of just a meme mod for YouTube. But I mean, the reason we're doing it is because it's actually a really fun category. There's so many shortcuts. This track, in fact, has three shortcuts, like right away. We just did two, and this next one, we're gonna actually, I guess this is kind of one too. You can skip this entire gorge. Boom, and then there's another one here, do the gap jump. Unfortunately, we hit the wall pretty badly, but that was still really good. We got a 17 second lap on gorge. And that was solid too. And, yes. All right, 14 second lap. This is amazing. That was perfect. Okay, this is a really good Mushroom Gorge. No! Oh. That's a good respawn. Oh, I missed the startup boost. The one time I need to get it. We're gonna be missing most of the startup boost today. Cause as you can see, if you get it, <laughs> you reach max speed instantly. And I don't even know what it is. It's like over a thousand KMH, I think. It's just something stupid. All right, Toad's Factory, I'm gonna forget that ever happened. I can't believe we fell off. Oh, that was such a good Mushroom Gorge. So there's a really cool shortcut on this one, and I'm hoping I can showcase it for you guys. All right, here we go. I'm gonna go for it every lap, because I am a shortcut degenerate. Oh, no, I can't go for it here. Can't go for it. It was uh, too much speed and not the right angle. And I didn't want to go backwards. I try to avoid going backwards. Perfect, perfect run first now, nice. That's the 200cc shortcut, but it works even better on the CC. All right, right here, charge mean turbo, launch. Oh, yes, okay, so that's not even the full shortcut. That's the best That's the best part. You guys didn't even get to see the full shortcut. Oh, I'm falling off, I'm falling off. That's not good, that's not good. And where's the respawn? Beautiful. Okay, okay, I'm not too upset. 24 is fine. I'm gonna do even better here though. Watch this guys, watch this. Right here. Perfect. One minute. That was an incredible lap. You see how much you can cut? You can end uh, you can end the lap in I don't even know how much time that was. 10, 15 seconds. And we skipped a straightaway, a corner, a massive U-turn conveyor belt 
another corner, the exit of the factory, and the bump section. We skipped all of that by just tricking off the ramp at the right angle and charging a meter boat and going a ridiculous speed. And you guys will see even crazier shortcuts later in the speed run when we phase through walls in order to cut off significant portions of the tracks. This track does not have anything special. This is actually one of the hardest ones because uh, this track doesn't really, well, it's one of the hardest ones to beat the CPUs on. Let me just put it that way. The CPUs are really good at this one. Even on 150cc, it's one of their best courses. It's really weird. I don't know why Nintendo decided to make this one so challenging. Okay. But yeah, the, the curvature of this track is not is not very good for the CC. You can see, you can't really hug the walls too well. The best ones are the ones where you can wrap around the walls super easily. Like Waluigi Stadium and uh, Coconut Mall are amazing. So we got Coconut Mall coming up next. You guys are going to really enjoy that one. But yeah, even though this is like a total meme category, it's so fun to speedrun. It's one of my favorite speedruns. We forgot to split. I mean, you guys saw how far ahead or behind we were. I didn't even get to see it. I was not even paying attention to the split. Oh my gosh, <laughs> a minute 14 it says, yikes. I forgot to split on the very first split. Well, if you guys used to watch my speed runs, you know, nothing new. I was known, I was known for not splitting. I would forget so often. And it's funny because uh, I only split every fourth track and a lot of people like to split every track when they do Mario Kart speed runs. Right, this, this is this is insane. Oh my gosh, we kind of got lucky there. We got bumped back into alignment. And this track's amazing because the curvature. It's so smooth. And there's not that many right angles. Look at this. Shortcut. Top route. Boom. Yeah. There's even a face through wall shortcut on this one, but we're not going for it. It's too risky. It's not that consistent and it doesn't save enough. So it's totally not worth it. And there's a really good chance you'll fall out of bounds when you go for it. So those reasons are the reasons we won't go for it. But it's really cool. You can take my word for it. Oh, oh, okay, I was afraid I was gonna get stuck up there. I actually did a speed run of this once where I got stuck up there and lost over 40 seconds and had to reset the run. Not even kidding. Because I don't always get this on the first time. Even though I'm commentating this live while I'm playing it, like this is my third attempt today. So I had an attempt where I got past Rainbow Road and I ended up quitting on, I think it was uh, Delfino Square or Waluigi Stadium. So we got really far. And then I had another attempt where I failed in the in the Flower Cup, which is the cup we're in right now. So this is the third attempt and my voice is already getting tired of talking, but we're gonna power through it. And hopefully we can uh, get a PB despite the one minute time loss due to black loading screens. Hopefully we can pull it off. We have the skills for it. Let's see. All right, that was a really tough beginning. Yes, we didn't fall off. That's the key for this track. You just don't want to fall off there. And we're getting a lot of speed here. I hope I don't fall off. Yes. Straight into a wall, just what we wanted. Okay, and what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go around and wrap around with this corner. See, because if you take this one, then it wraps you around really nicely. And the other one will shoot you out of bounds a lot. So I like to take the left one. And we got lucky there again. Sometimes we shoot out of bounds there. So we got super lucky to not fall out of bounds. Oh, we got a lot of speed. This is too much. This is too much. Bad, 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 bad. Wait, wait, wait. Oh. All right, so it's going to give me a really bad respawn. However, I... Oh, never mind. We're good. We're good. This is fine. This is fine. There's there's a really bad one you can get at the beginning of the track, and it completely messes up your checkpoints. And I was afraid I got that one. Yes, we're on lap three. Yeah. Oh, that was so cool. Unorthodox for sure. Wow, in the candy we got 674. That's crazy. All right. I don't even get really a chance to look at the speedometer very often. That's just for you guys. Because I'm too focused on the madness that is happening. Look at that. <laughs> I shot through the wooden sign, finished in epic fashion. All righty. Really, really happy with that DK Summit. Because on DK Summit, sometimes you fall out of bounds, you fall for forever, and then it gives you the respawn at the beginning of the course, and you get no lap count, and you have to redo part of, part of the lap. It is brutal. Um, but yeah, anyway, this track has some fun shortcuts. I'll try my best to execute them. Yep, beautiful. Burning out at the beginning. Oh, got it. Haha. <laughs> Oh, almost got that one too. Oh my god, I almost got both of them back to back. That would have been so amazing after burning out. Like, oh man. Okay, okay, I'm still very happy we got the first one. Because that angle was not great and I was able to just 
bank off the the what's it called the the cave like the wall of the cave the outside wall of the cave like at, oh can I do it again? Yeah, oh it's, it's easy. Look at that. I just did it twice in a row. Oh, oh my god, that post is annoying. I wish I could just remove that post from this track. I want a custom track. It's Royals Goldmine without that post, and it's got the 99999 CC speed mod. That would be a great custom track. I'm gonna get it lap three. I failed it the first two laps. I was close lap one. Lap two was terrible. Ooh, there's a really cool 400 CC shortcut on this track also. Amazing, three for three. Let me get this one now. Oh, okay, I wanna remove that post also. I wanna remove the vertical and the horizontal post. And I wanna remove, uh, who was that that bumped me off? Was that Rosalina? Oh man, this was such a good gold mine. There were so many epic moments with the shortcuts. But overall, very upset. <laughs> I just tried to go straight and see if I could cut that off. And now I'm getting very carried away. Wow. Oh my god, despite me falling off 3,000 times on Goldmine, I'm actually going to be ahead right now on the splits, which is crazy. Wow, we're ahead 6.8 seconds, which means we're really ahead like 23 seconds or something. Dang, we take those. All right, well, I mean, the first three tracks were really solid. Goldmine is just insanely impossible. I was happy to get that one shortcut three times, though. Like, that was impressive. That was the saving grace for that terrible run. All right, this is another track where you can lose to the CPUs quite easily. Not like that actually matters, but it's just more humorous, if anything. That was really good. That was an awesome shortcut. I skipped both the, uh, I, I will call it the figure eight section of the track, so you guys all are on the same page as me. Have you guys seen the ultra shortcut on this track? Found just a couple weeks ago, maybe not even. Check my Twitter if you haven't. I retweeted the ultra shortcut, or just type in Daisy Circuit Ultra Shortcut on YouTube. I'm sure it'll come up. It is insane. They use the sign and they use a tree and it's one of the coolest ultra shortcuts I've ever seen. It's one of the most ridiculous ones, that's for sure. And I mean, this game is filled with the most ridiculous shortcuts ever. So the fact I'm saying that, <laughs> you know it means something. Um, and then there was also one, you guys see Birdo on the minimap? Oh, Birdo's gone. Baby Luigi now, it's going crazy. All right, that was a pretty good Daisy Circuit, not gonna lie. But yeah, the, the GCN Mario Circuit glitch that got discovered recently is also really cool. It's a respawn glitch. And who knows, maybe we'll see it in a three lap record sometime. But I think it takes two mushrooms and it only saves like a second or two. So it's something like only viable for a one lap uh, speedrun record, time trial record, not for a three lap. However, the, uh, the Daisy Circuit one, who knows, maybe that one is useful for a three lap. I don't know. I'm no tool assist expert, but I think it's cool. That's for sure. Oh, I got bumped, got really lucky not to fall off there. And... Nice, nice shortcut. Okay, okay, I improvised there, that was not planned. But this is an incredible Koopa Cape lap. Wow. Actually really happy with how the speedrun's going now that I think about it. Like, this could be going so much worse. All right, I'm gonna try to replicate that shortcut again. You know what? <laughs> that was pretty cool. <laughs> that was like Mushroom Gorge. Bonk, 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 bonk. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, that was great. Oh, oh, can I do this without falling off? The answer is somehow yes. Never mind. <laughs> we fall off on the easy part and we survive the hard part. Yeah! Oh man, that shortcut's weird. Happy to get it though. Because that corner's annoying. There's nowhere for me to hug the walls, so you gotta take it really slow or else you'll get stuck behind like some of the coral um, or one of the rock cavern walls. You get stuck in one of the corners and you have to pivot and then slowly get out of it. I've had it happen. You lose like literally six or seven seconds. So we avoided that every lap. We pulled off the cool shortcut twice, two and a half times kind of. Rode the wall for a while on that one on lap two. That was a fun one. We're on a roll right now. I mean, we're on a shortcut roll. We definitely had a rough Warriors Gold Mine, but the last six of the last seven have been solid. All right, and now we approach the second hardest track of the speed run, Rainbow Road being the hardest. These two are significantly harder than everything else. It's not even a competition. I am not looking forward to this. We're gonna have a rough time. I, 
can assure you that. Oh, really good start though, really good start. Normally I've already fallen off once by now. Okay. I'm gonna be tapping A like once a second in order to get past some of these sections. And so far so good. This is a really tough section because of the boost panels. Hitting the boost panels is the worst thing that can happen. You get way too much speed and you can lose a lot of time. This is the best Maple Tree lap I've ever driven on 99999cc. Yeah, that's the best one I've ever driven, for sure. I can't believe I just did that without falling off. <laughs> wow. Wow. See, that's what happens normally. You just shoot out of bounds like that. Well, you shoot up top, and then if you try to complete the lap from there, it won't give you a lap count. And, I mean, ultra shortcuts wouldn't be allowed anyway, even if it was an ultra. This is a no ultra shortcut speed run. Okay. That was still really good. Yes, okay, I did not want to go up that blue ramp. That's like one of the worst things you can do. This is still really good. This is like phenomenal, guys. If you haven't watched previous 9999 CC speedruns, you know, like, I mean, this might not look like anything, like anything special, but this track can really screw you over. Like, you get stuck in the same respawn point, and like, sometimes you can't get past certain sections. It's easy for this one to take over three minutes. I'm not kidding. So I'm like overjoyed right now at how this is going. I just need to get past the U-turn one more time and we are home free. Right here. The boost panels are also a trap. It's this part, it's the hardest part. We did it, there we go. It's a hard left and then a hard right pretty much. Yeah! Oh my gosh, 159. I'm gonna give you guys a reference. I'm gonna find my previous speed run. I have it pulled up right now on YouTube. And let me find the time that I got. I got two, oh my God, I got 251. I just beat my time by 52 seconds. 52 seconds. Okay, that's a uh, big motivation right there. This is going really well. I'm not getting a startup boost. As you can see, I don't want to deal with the CPUs. They will be respawning here forever for the entire <laughs> for the entire race because they can't get past that part. They always get the startup boost and they shoot off the edge because of the angle. Um, but we're going to be doing this really ridiculous shortcut. It's right here. We're going to aim for that rock. Boom! And ladies and gentlemen, that is not an ultra shortcut. Why is it not an ultra shortcut? Because we actually went through every every single key checkpoint on Grown Volcano. Yes, there are no key checkpoints for half of the lap. Why, Nintendo? I have no idea. Thank you, Nintendo. I love you for doing that because this track is broken on every CC, on every game mode, and it is glorious. Bonk. That is so, so beautiful. And I'm even better at that shortcut than I used to be. Um, if you guys watched the previous speed run, I do not do it as well as I'm doing it there. I practiced it. I put in a solid hour and a half, two hours of practice today for this uh, for this video. Had to make sure I uh, beat my time, you know? Okay, here we go. Bonk! And, oh my gosh, 110 on Grumble. I, I can't wait to see the split. Oh man, that was a perfect, that was a perfect uh, whatever cup this is, star cup. Let's see what we get. 41 seconds, oh, and the crowd goes wild. So, you know, we're up at an extra 24 seconds because of the two second load times. We're up over a minute from our previous time after just 12 tracks. I mean, hey guys, a lot can go wrong in these speed runs. So, I mean, we're far from through this. Like, <laughs> we have a lot to go, but this is a phenomenal start. Phenomenal. All right. Oh no, oh no. Okay, that cactus actually helped me. Even though it didn't look like it, it did. I was headed somewhere not good. You do not want to hit that zipper. That zipper can send you out of bounds and you'll get screwed over forever. So I was uh, very fortunate to get out of that with uh, minimal damage. Yikes. Oh no. Off this. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. I thought it would give me way more, way more distance. This is not a great dry dry ruins, but there's no like catastrophic mistakes, so I'm feeling okay. Feeling okay. 
I just keep hitting these guys. These guys are my best friends today. Alright, that's fine. Beautiful. Great ending. Okay, 111. I'll take it. Let's see what I got on my uh, current PV on this track. 104. Okay, so we lost some time there, but that was expected. Still up like 34, 35 seconds. <laughs> well, we just lost 4 seconds to load time, so about 30 seconds now. <laughs> oh, man. All right, move you. This one's really fun. I actually enjoy this track more on this CC than I do on 150cc, if I'm being honest. And it's got a really cool shortcut at the beginning here. You can hug the wall. Let's see if we can get it. Hug the wall. Oh, I did it totally wrong. I'll, I'll do it better next lap. Right, coming super inside, beautiful. Nice. Okay, let me see if I can do this better. It's like that, see? Th that was okay, that, that was decent. Oh my god, I somehow survived that. Wow, this track is so fun. I'm having the best time. All right. Look at that. Bonk. Oh, I didn't bonk. That was even better than bonking. How did I not hit anything? How am I not hitting any cars on Moonview Highway 99999cc? This is a miracle. Oh my god, that was insane. I need to see what I got on my previous PB. Because my previ previous PB has some really good moments, don't get me wrong. I got 104, so I just gained 10 seconds. Let's go. Oh, man. Okay, Bowser's Castle. This one has a really cool shortcut that I might try on lat 3. Depends on how the rest of the run goes. And this is one of the few tracks where we actually want to get the startup boost as opposed to the other ones. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, man, that is gorgeous. What a start. And then this track has some nice curves. Trust me. It's so fun to play. And we're bouncing over the fireball. Gotta love it. And we'll, like I said, we'll try the shortcut in the next lap. Oh, oh, okay, we're good, we're good. And don't want to go too fast here. You can easily fly off. The invisible wall is very, very low right there. Very low. And this part, you're going to have to hit the wall. Wait, I somehow did it without hitting the wall. How did I do that? I always hit the wall there. Wow, that was really lucky. Oh, okay, so I actually shot through the bridge. I'm not kidding you guys. I shot through the bridge right there. So we will do some shortcuts where we shoot through walls later in the speedrun. For now, let's not get fireballed. Over the fireball. Baby Mario's got some hops. Let's go. Baby Mario at the Olympic Games. And yeah, we're saving the shortcut for next lap. See, the invisible wall. It's so low. Where's this going to respawn me? Uh, Okay, that's an amazing respawn point. We take those. That's great. Not too upset now. And we learned we don't have to hit that up top. I thought you always have to hit that thing up top. This is solid. Oh, man, that was great. We're just absolutely speeding through this track right now. Oh, man, Rainbow Road's next. I'm not looking forward to Rainbow Road. Rainbow Road is brutal on the CC. It's so brutal. Okay, I'm going to try the shortcut because I'm crazy. I don't know if this is a good idea. Eh, what can go wrong? Oh, you know what? We're going to get the respawn. Look where this is going to respawn me. Yep, at the end. Let's go. I'm not upset at all. Let's go. Yeah, so it's really cool. Um, pretty much how it works is you're going off that one wall that I flew over on lap two and you're shooting over the invisible barrier because it's so low and then you're landing up top at the top of the spiral, kind of like the 150cc glitch does. So it doesn't really cut that much time. You're only gonna save like a second or two, but it looks really cool. And the reason why it doesn't save that much is because you have to charge that sandstone main turbo. I am not going to get the startup boost. The only way to do this without falling off is to go very slow like this. And then immediately nosedive. Nosedive hard. And we still didn't make it, but we were close. But this is something that is only possible on the CTGP variant. And this part, oh man, this part's really tough. Oh man, we're going to fall off so much here. I'm not looking forward to this. This is the le my least favorite part of the speedrun, for obvious reasons. We're going to fall off 30 times. Mm, maybe not 30. We're going to fall off 15 times. With ease, it, it's just, it's so hard, it's so hard. Oh man, okay, I just have to, I just have to stay patient. <laughs> I 
It's hard to be patient. I need to really focus now because I'm losing a lot of time. Because the rest of the run has been pretty phenomenal. Oh my gosh, I'm losing my patience. I don't have the patience for this, guys. I don't have it. We're at 51. We're not even halfway through this freaking lap. Jesus. Okay, at least we got lucky there. So sometimes when you shoot through the cannon, because you have to fall off there every lap. It's a, it's a rule of the speed run. Um, you have to fall, fall off there. So sometimes what happens is you shoot into space and it doesn't respawn you for a while. And unfortunately, when that happens, you get really screwed over. Okay, that's good. I wanted to fall off there. It's going to put me after the ramp. Good, good. Okay, we're almost done with lap one. It's been torture. Okay, hang on. Really slow. Nose dive, nose dive, nose dive. B, hold B. Still not enough. Still not enough. Too much speed. And this part's really hard too. Yeah, I don't even know how to do that part. That is so tough. Oh man. Oh my god. Help me, help me. I'm losing my sanity, but it's it's warranted, you know what I mean? I'm just so impatient with this track. So impatient. Okay, at least it shot me off quick. I'm gonna not fall off for the remainder of this race, except for one time, watch this. And that time, that time doesn't count. Not gonna fall off anymore. That was really good, I did that part super fast. That doesn't count as falling off. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, nice, nice. Yes, 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 that's perfect. Nose dive, nose dive, nose dive. Break, break. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? Okay, okay. Let the CPU, oh gosh, CPUs are so deadly here. Yes, yes. Yeah! Okay, I did that part without falling off. I'm so happy. So that means I can do this part without falling off now. I'm gonna hold hard right, hard right. I need to lose all my speed and then pivot. The pivot was successful. Hold right. I'm hard. I'm holding right as hard as I can, guys. As hard as I possibly can. And this is a really good recovery. Rainbow Road's been brutal, obviously, but at least we're having a good ending here. That was solid. I almost did that like perfectly. And I'm gonna just. I tried to do the same thing I did last time. Dang it. I'm serious guys, like that, that part's impossible to do without falling off. So I'm trying to fall off as quick as possible. Ooh, good respawn. Too good of a respawn. I wasn't ready for it. Oh man. 338. I don't even want to look what I got on the last one. Okay, look at us though. We're still killing it. We're still ahead so much. The other three were phenomenal. Well, Moonview was and so was Bowser's Castle. Like those went really well. We're up 38 seconds. Okay. That's not bad. Let me see what I got on Rainbow Road on my previous run. Oh, I got like 340 or something. Okay, that makes me feel so much better. So I had the same level of disgustingness happen to me in my PB. Good to know, good to know. Oh, the beach ducks, they're on the prowl. They're hungry, they're fishing for a fight, and hopefully they're hungry for the CPUs and not human blood. Okay, so far so good. Oh, never mind, never mind, we're dead. <laughs> Commentator's curse. No, no, what? That made no sense whatsoever. Are you serious? Jeez. All right, this part's really fun though. You just hold right and you tap A the whole time and you go bonk, bonk, bonk. My favorite part of the level. Bonk. I like right when the CPU like takes control, just immediately jets into the water like full speed. Zoom! Look at the CPU controlling the thing. The CPU has more fun of 9999 CC than we do. All right, what's up next? Yoshi Falls. Oh, I had like the best Yoshi Falls ever in my previous run. I watched it. Like I had some crazy stuff happen. If you haven't seen the previous speedrun, I'll put it in the description. And you guys gotta watch. You guys gotta watch Yoshi Falls. It was epic. Had some clutch moments. Hopefully we can emulate that here. <laughs> I just immediately fell off. Oh man. There's a shortcut right here though. I kind of did part of it. 
You guys see what it is. That was not good. This is a tough one. Like, I'm losing to multiple CPUs here. Alright, 34 seconds. Brutal. It's okay. It's Yoshi Falls. It's whatever. But normally, you can wheelie there, and you can... If you wheelie off the bridge, you can get so much air that you can clear past the third waterfall from the bridge where the second waterfall is. So it's it's really good. And it's much better than having to go around that corner slowly because it's easy to fall off there and there's a boost panel. So that's why it's great. The CPUs cheat, that's why they finish so fast. <laughs> I thought the CPU was gonna make me do the ultra shortcut there for a moment. Dang, oh, that was really brutal. I'm gonna do this. And I'm gonna hit this block, and they all fall on offline mode, so it's pretty scary. The second you hit them, they fall. Different than online. Look at these blocks are not there anymore. And now that one's not there, but it's okay, we're doing the shortcut. We didn't do that shortcut last time. On the last speed run, we just went around the corner every time. I think it's faster just to, uh, you know, pivot after doing the cut. Bonk. Like, yeah, I think that's faster. Because this thing has such good acceleration. Alright, 45. Not too shabby. And now we got Mario Raceway. This one has a really fun cut where you can fly over the mountain just like on 200cc. But you can, also, you can also bypass the massive invisible wall. Like, one of the biggest walls, invisible walls in the game. Like, honestly. And uh, we'll see uh, what we can do here. All right, I'm immediately gonna go into the grass. And here is the shortcut. Voila, it's so easy, I love it. And we're gonna go over here and hug this wall and finish the lap in record, record time. And nice, okay, I was happy to hit that invisible wall. <laughs> Cause if we miss it, then we're gonna fly for a while and lose a lot of time. A lot of hugging walls in this game, a lot of hugging trees in this game mode. Oh, failed it. Well, let's hope for a good respawn point. That's okay. All right, we got it two laps though, which is good. That's fine, I'm not too upset. 47, okay. And we're losing a lot of time though. I remember my shell and banana cup were my best, my best performances in my last speed run. Like, those were by far my best two cups. So I was expecting to lose some time here, and I'll probably lose the rest of the time here, and hopefully we can make it up on the Leaf and the Lightning Cup. It's gonna be really hard to to do well on, uh, to, to replicate what I did on this cup in my last video. Oh my gosh, I wasn't even going that fast. Oh my gosh. Annoying! There we go. I gotta get serious, because I actually have a chance to beat my time here. This is a really good run overall, like for me. And it's still riddled with like a million mistakes, but this is just, it's impossible game mode. It's impossible speeds. That was really good. Yeah, too much, too much. Um, I'm, I'm holding hard right and hard left pretty much the entire run, guys. It's like, but it doesn't look like it because you just can't turn that quick when you're going so fast. Not bad, not bad. Okay, 110. And I know I got a much better time than that. I Oh, I got 103. Okay, so I lost seven seconds there. So yeah, I lost quite a bit. Hopefully we can uh, have a really good ending to this cup. This one I'm pretty good at. We have to be really, really mindful of the elevation change between the sandy portion of the track and the, the uh, shallow water because it is pretty noticeable on the CC. You can kind of feel it. The divots are uh, way more noticeable than on 150cc. 
Look at that, you get so much air, and you can't break it all when you're getting air. So it's <laughs> critical that we're breaking in this speed mode too. Because we're, we're tapping A a lot too. <laughs> I just went right through that tree. Ah, the speeds you reach in this game mode, it's ridiculous. Amazing, 32 seconds. What did I get in my PB? Let me check. I got 34 seconds. Nice. Okay, got a little bit of time back. We take that. We take that. Very happy. And Delfino. All right, this one's got the double shortcut. Obviously, it's got a really funky ending shortcut. And there's actually a little mini inhuman shortcut you can pull off here. Watch if I can do it. Oh man, but yeah, you can cut the fountain off. And if you guys have seen my Inhuman Shortcut video collaboration with Enmi from like 2019, we showcased that shortcut. It's one of the few that hasn't been pulled off yet, to my knowledge, uh, from that video. A lot of them have been pulled off, which is absurd. I can't believe the Mario Kart community. Oh, I almost got it. Okay, I'll try to get it at lap three. But you can shoot through that and cut a little bit off. Pretty cool. Oh! Oh, I almost got it. Okay, at least I got that ending cut for you guys, though. You can see how cool that is. Makes it so you don't have to take the last turn slowly. Because the elevation from the ramp to the flat ground, you have to do that part pretty slow, unless you're doing the shortcut. Maybe I'll get to try it here also. Oh, I tried to face through the wall. That's why I did that. Oh, man, that would have been cool if I got that. I should have wheelied. Because uh, the bridge was down, and you can actually shoot through the wall and hit the finish line. And it's a great way to finish the race. You'll be headed out of bounds after, but it won't matter because you're done with the race. It's a really cool one. Should have wheelied. I could have maybe gotten it. I'm trying to think what my favorite shortcut was of the speedrun. Grumble Volcano was clutch. That was insane. Um, all three of those. Let's see, what else was good? Royals Goldmine, we had that one three for three as well, which was surprising. Oh, this one's kind of tough, but this one's really fun. Like, look at this. This track was made for this CC. Made for it. Look at this. Made for it. That was a great lap. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Wait, how, how did that even happen? That's what I want to know. How did that even happen? That was amazing. Oh my gosh, this track was made for this. 20 second lap. What even is that? What is even happening? I, I, I can't believe how I shot literally fully perpendicular from this ramp into this wall. And look, it just curved me around. It'll do it again. Yeah, see? This track was made for this CC. Oh! We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good, we're good. We're good, we're good. Oh man. Oh! 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 If I would have gotten past the ramp, that would have been so cool. <laughs> that was still really good. Oh my god. That was insane. Yeah. Look at this. We're ahead so much. Did I just die on Waluigi? No, I got 106. Wow. How am I ahead by that much? What the heck? Watch this shortcut, guys. Boom! And watch this one. <laughs> okay, well that's not really worth it. <laughs> um, watch this one. <laughs> it's the the track's a giant shortcut. But yeah, my strategy is I'm trying to do this and bounce off that. Oh, I want to bounce off that, then ricochet, and then be put where the first mound is. Um, the good news is, oh no, I'm going to hit that bounce again. Okay, I need to focus. This is terrible. I could do much better than this. Dude, something must have went horribly wrong on my PV. I'll try this again. Come on, come on, bounce. Yeah, I want to do that, see? Oh! Oh! 
I got, I got the, oh my god! <laughs> I can't believe that counted the lap. I can't believe the finish line extends that far out. That's amazing. What? Oh, you know what's possible? I probably forgot to split. That's probably what happened on the banana. I probably forgot to split like until like Desert Hills or something. I don't know. I don't know what happened. I just can't believe I'm up a minute and eight, 18 seconds right now. It's very possible I messed up my splits. All right, I gotta stop fixating on this. We got Bowser's Castle to play. I just I can't believe that happened on Desert Hills. That was my favorite part of the whole speedrun. All right. Yeah, I got the shortcut. Nice, beautiful. It's not really worth going for. I probably won't go for a lap two and three. I just wanted to get it from the third ramp because no one really ever gets to see that. It's always the first ramp, sorry, the first platform and the second platform are where you do the shortcut, not the third platform. How about the fifth platform? Ah, Close. <laughs> oh, I'm having too much fun. This speed run's too much fun. This is the best speed run ever. Okay. 25.8, not too shabby. And we gotta watch out for the CPUs now. Ooh. Aww. Will this give me a good respawn at least? No. Fine, we'll do that. That was not good, guys, not good. I got a little too carried away. Yeah, 119. Let's see what I got. I got 118 in my previous run, so that's not even that much different. We're chilling, we're chilling. <laughs> I still can't get over Desert Hills. <laughs> I can't get over that ending. I did the shortcut perfectly, where I skip the U-turn, bonk off the piece of scenery, like the weird block structure, land, then pivot, and then just shoot for the hills, and then finish in midair. Like, what even was that? Oh man, I can't get over it. All right, I'm over it. DK Jungle Parkway, here we go. We're doing the massive shortcut here. Oh! Ah. Oh. Almost. Almost. The louder you scream, the better chance you have of facing through the walls. That's what I've learned from doing multiple runs of the speedrun. That's why you might wonder why I'm screaming like an idiot throughout the run. I'm just trying to improve my chances of success. Okay, not the greatest lap. Yeah, not the greatest. Oh, we stayed on. Hang on. I'm gonna do something cheeky. Are you serious? Oh, I'm so upset I didn't get that. I'm so I'm so upset. I'm so upset. I'm losing time for no reason. Okay, I'm, I'm done being stupid. We have a big lead. And we're gonna play smart now. Okay, I'm gonna try to phase through three walls. Right here. <laughs> I phased through about five. And where's this gonna respawn me? Oh, that's great. Look at this respawn, guys. Okay, that's that's really good put us uh, multiple corners in front of where we uh, stencil meter road from. That's really good. I'm totally fine with that. I am going to try this strategy again because I'm stubborn. I, I just want to get this. Are you serious, game? Are you... Oh, man, I'm so upset. I practiced that and I could get that, no problem. I don't know why it's not working. I'm not being like an idiot for no reason. I'm being a an idiot for <laughs> a reason. Oh, okay, well, it's gonna give me a good respawn, but I'm I'm phasing through too many walls. This normally isn't the problem. No, that's a terrible respawn. It's gonna make me go around this corner, too. Oh, man, this is the worst parkway ever. Oh, man. Bummer. It's okay, it's okay. 208. Disgusting. Let's see what I got in my previous run. I got 156. All right, that makes me not feel too bad, honestly. Wait, no, okay, I'm only 51 seconds ahead. The clock is ticking. That's what happened, guys. That's what happened last split. I just split too late. I was, I'm not actually a minute 18 ahead. It was deceiving, and now I made all those mistakes because I was getting cocky because I thought I was up a bunch, and now I'm gonna lose all of it. Oh no, not like this. All right, all right, we gotta finish strong, guys. OK, 
Okay, that was pretty good. We're gonna be down at least 20 seconds though. That's the scariest part about it. This track is impossible to play on this game mode. It just doesn't work. Ouch. 20 again. Okay. I have an idea. I gotta go for the ultra shortcut. Or the glitch or whatever. Yeah, it's, it's not an ultra. It's a glitch. These ultras are banned on this category that I made up. Oh, I tried to do a phase through wall thing. Dude, the wall phasing is not working today. Like, what is going on? It's been a major bummer. Alright, I am extremely upset right now. I am down by over half a minute. And if you factor in all the black screens where we're losing two seconds per race, you know, and you times 28 by 2, 56 seconds. So we've lost 56 seconds to black screen. So we're actually up like 20 seconds right now. Just keep that in mind. But we're doing our best, and I will put calculations in the description of how this run fared versus my my previous 99999 CC time. Because it's just hard to make it accurate when... Yes! Oh, got that perfect. Yeah! Well, <laughs> the ending could have been a little better, but still. But yeah, I, I want it to be accurate. I'm, I'm curious to see if we're actually beating it or not. Here we go. Yeah, I got it again. That skips the entire U-turn, which is amazing, because the U-turn is a pain. It's a pain. This section's a pain. This track's a pain. And I'm gonna get it again, because we're lucky today. Told you, three for three. 42, not bad, not bad. Needed that. I got 53, guys, I got 53 in my last run. So we just shaved 11 seconds. Let's go. All right, this is doable. This is doable. We just need the perfect run. The absolute perfection of perfection of runs. No mistakes, no falling off. Three for three shortcut execution. I'm gonna fall off here, aren't I? Oh my gosh, the CPUs are relentless. They're evil. There's nothing I could have done right there except not get the starter boost, which I thought about. Also, I discovered a new strat here, which I'm gonna implement when I was practicing earlier today. It's gonna be right here. I'm gonna wheelie off this. Ah, oh, okay, I didn't get it, but uh, didn't get that either. Okay, so this is a terrible first lap. Yeah, that was the worst first lap possible. I'm gonna try to do better here, lap two and three, so I can show showcase what I was talking about. Because we normally face through the wall, but it wasn't working that well. No, I messed it up again. Mm. All right, we'll get this part. Yep, we didn't hit the tree. Well, we did hit the tree, but we still pulled it off. I want to get that thing I was talking about. It's right here. It's right here. Nope, couldn't get it. Okay, at least we got to do that one. Everyone's favorite shortcut now. The hit the tree shortcut. Okay. That was rough. I'm losing hope for the speed run. But I'm trying to have fun. Okay. What was my DK Mountain time? Let me check. My DK Mountain time was 212. Oh, okay, okay. That's not very good. Maybe I can make up a lot of time here. Alright, I'm gonna super try hard it. This is me tryharding it the most I can tryhard anything in my life. Here we go. 674. Nice. And now we have to do the crazy strat, guys. Try to sell some damage over here. Aim for the finish line. I didn't get it. I didn't get it. I was off. How was I off by that much? That wasn't even... Okay, wait, wait, no. We're chilling. We're chilling. That's an amazing respawn point. All right, we're fine. We're fine. I feel so much better now. If we do that three times, that's a 154. And remember, the time we're trying to beat is a 212. Like, I feel so much better now. I was not expecting that amazing respawn point. All right, all right.
Okay, here we go. Attempt number two. Let's try to correct our mistakes. Yes! Yeah, I got it. I got it. You see that? I'm already in the cannon. And I got the lap count in midair. Okay, we're falling off here. I'm not too upset if I can fast fall. I'm fast falling as quickly as I can. And if this respawns me after the turn, I'll be pretty happy. Nope. Thank you, game, for being stupid. This part's really annoying. Alright, guys, if I get super lucky here, we could just we could shave 20 seconds. I'm not kidding you. Right here, right here. Come on, guys, come on. Lining it up. Yes! Yes! 148. We just shaved 24 seconds. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, this just got really interesting now. <laughs> this is like maybe doable. Um, let's see here. What was my time? I'm checking it. I got a 140. No, no, no. I got a 150. I got a 150. I got to beat a 150 here. All right. Wish me luck. Here we go. Oh, man. This is going to be fun. I'm excited. Try not to make any stupid mistakes. <laughs> that thwomp almost landed on me. I mean, hey, that would be kind of good to be squished because then it would slow me down. So I wouldn't even be upset, honestly. Okay, we're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Yeah! That was perfect. What's up, Toad? What's up? Yeah, this track's tough, Toad. Don't be too upset. Alright, alright. <laughs> nice. I'm going so slow, but it's working. <laughs> did the little shortcut that I could have done last lap. I don't know why I didn't cut through the grass. <laughs> There's no point for me to obey off-road rules when we have this much speed. Nice. Yes! 52-57! Let's go! Oh! We did it! <laughs> wow, I overcame all the odds there at the end. That was a great last last cup. And keep in mind that we uh, made some really dumb mistakes on Parkway, so we could have shaved an additional 20 to 30 seconds if we weren't... Probably like 25 seconds if we weren't being an idiot with uh, our strategy we were trying to do with that U-turn skip. So I was really happy to gain all that time back. And the banana cup split is not correct and neither is the mushroom cup split. One of them was a mistake I made on this run and the other one was the one I, the mistake I made on the last run. So we ended with 456 points out of 480. It's pretty funny, we lost 24 points to the CPUs. Wario with second, Funky Kong with third. And wow, that was so much fun. I did so many cool shortcuts. I can't wait to upload this. All right, hope you guys enjoyed. Hit the like button if you wanna see some 99999cc videos in the future, online races, and you know, another speed run sometime. All right, thanks for watching. Enjoy Funky Kong dancing and peace.